so tell me about the the Philippines uh, story. Ah, uh, yeah. So I got tagged, and I'm trying to remember. I'm gonna leave the year and all that stuff out for our previous comments. Sure. Um, someone had shot at one of the SF advisors and killed him. Oh my God. Uh, we showed up. I was tagged to a SFODA. Um, keeping in mind that happy hour starts at 5 p.m. Very important. So, yes. And this was when Nipa Hut, Fire Empire, and all the great bars existed right outside of Clark. And it was okay. like right outside the fence, not on that side adjacency. It was literally right outside the fence. You could see the bright, pretty lights from the fence line, which was okay. nice. So we're a little bit further down in an area called Kappa Starlack. And we went hunting and it was essentially, we're going to roll these guys up one at a time and mm -hmm. one's going to lead us to another and another and another. So we were doing that, but, um, <laughs> five cock rolls around, we're at the bar. So there was a whole lot of hunting that did not happen because we're at the bar. Uh, sure, sure. about 20 years later, I show back up in the Philippines for a reunion amongst some guys that still live there. And there's this guy down the table, a local. Um, and I'm looking at him. I'm like, man, that guy's super familiar. You know, what team was he on? Because there was a whole bunch of guys. There were they essentially grabbed <coughs> SF dudes from across the across the Pacific Rim to go in there and do this. And you know, everybody was kind of diverse and different different things that were going on. Mostly first group, but you know, it was all these different guys. And then me and a Marine Corps liaison guy. Okay. Um. But I'm looking at this guy, and I'm like, what the hell? So I ask him, and he actually helps. And he's like, you're, you're looking at me like you know me, but you probably don't. And he says, you probably saw my picture on the wall. I was one of the guys you guys were coming after. I'm like, really? And, and I'm like, he's at a reunion for this? And what the? He's like, yeah, well, after a period of time, my wife said I can either stay with her or I can keep fighting, you know, AK-47 style, blah, blah, blah. He said, so I, I stuck with her, and I joined the Aquino regime. The, essentially the bad guys that were fighting. <laughs> he said Jeez. it paid better. Yeah. Like, Hell. But yeah, it was uh it was kind of cowboy land. Um wow, we went out crazy. hunting dudes and it's like we're gonna make a point. You can shoot anybody you want, you just don't shoot at our guys. Period. Hey.